shop. It was built back in 1978. Um, the beaver will stay in there their entire life, the, the pair will, and they live about 20 years. So right now it's the third generation um, living in this house. So once the two parents pass, then one of the offspring will take over the house. So it would be the third generation now. How do you make them up? Oh, I'm just kidding. I can swim underneath. Are they communal? Are they? Is it more than one? Uh, this in that is, one? It's, it's the, the, the mating pair is in this one with their offspring, but they're very territorial. So this cove is for this lodge, and then we have two other lodges and two other coves that's their territory. So if another beaver came in here, they would fight one another. So, um, but the offspring, they stay in there for two years. On average, they have three to four, but they can have up to eight at a time. That house can hold 14 beaver in it, so they can hold quite a bit. And they are in their sleeping right now. Beaver are crepuscular, which means they're mostly active at dawn and dusk. So unless you're here really early or a little bit later, we won't be able to see them. So. Um, but when they're two, they actually move out, and they move into to smaller lodges up here, which I'll show you. I call them bachelor pads. They're like little single beaver pads, and they'll move in there for a year or less, kind of get established, you know, on their feet and stuff. And then after that, they will move out and leave this lake altogether. They will migrate 20 miles or more over land to go somewhere else to live. And they do that because to find a mate and also for the territorial purpose. So, so when they're two, so this when they're two, they're out. So, yeah, I'll you're out. Down. <laughs> <laughs> so which